All right, everybody. We are camping! So I'm camping this week with my family. I'm actually gonna be showing y'all what we're eating for the week, like four or five days, using the Instant Pot and like Crock Pot. And I'm gonna show y'all what we're cooking. Mommy, um, mommy, mommy. We just got a pop-up camper. We're not really cooking in the camper, we're cooking outside of the camper. So this is like easy stuff. Sybil. Okay, anyways, if you are interested in what we're eating for the week while camping, then keep on watching. We're going to use the Instant Pot. I'm gonna put it on saute. And we're gonna cook the ground beef. Okay y'all, so once the meat is cooked and the seasoning is mixed in, I'm going to add in diced tomatoes with green chilies. This is just like the Walmart brand. And then I'm gonna add in a can of chili beans. You can really add any type of beans that you want, but we're going with chili beans. And then I'm actually gonna add in kidney beans because I did have them, but just make sure to drain the kidney beans. Um, I was not able to open up the corn because I did not have a can opener so I just set this aside and then we're going to eat this with chips and shredded cheese. Okay guys, we are in the camper, day two, and I'm gonna make a crock pot meal for us to eat tonight. Your nose is running. Okay. Y'all, what? Okay, so we're gonna make um, crack chicken sliders. So I'm thinking about putting corn in it because I didn't get to use my corn in my last video. And I think my kids might like that. So I'm gonna show y'all how to make it. I don't have a lot of cooking space. I'm having to cook inside because it's raining. I've got my coffee pressing. All right, two ranch packets, cream cheese, cheese, bacon bits, and I've got some frozen chicken. We're gonna put this all in the crock pot. let it cook on high, shred it, and then we're gonna eat it with sliders. My kids are playing in the rain right now. All right, two chickens. I'm gonna start with the seasoning. I like to do seasoning first because it, helps, it gets the chicken done. I might just do one honestly because I'm only doing two chicken breast. Alright, bacon bits. What's really cool is there's been a lot of deer um, around our camper like this morning. So we opened up like the windows it's been so nice 
All right, I have two things of chick uh, cream cheese. Also, I don't think by now, if the camper remodel video is not up by now, then it might be the next video coming out, but I was going to show you all how I remodeled it. It turned out really, really good, and it was easy, very inexpensive. All right, we're going to do a little bit of shredded cheese. I'll do most of the shredded cheese like on the top at the end and I'm gonna cook this on high so when you're cooking chicken you have to be very careful really any meat like if you put chicken in the crock pot and it has time to thaw before it cooks you have the potential of um, like bacteria growing and you getting sick so you have to be careful. I have just started always doing my chicken on high for four hours because it immediately starts cooking it. So this is what it is looking like. I'm gonna cook my, my chicken right here. Okay, so the chicken is too dry for me, so I'm gonna put in this other thing of cream cheese right now and shred it up. And then we should be able to eat it for lunch. I feel like the corn gives it a good texture so it's pretty good okay <laughs> I was gonna um, rot rotate them the frozen chickens all right stick these are um, little chicken things from HEB I love this brand it's got Earl, they say on package it's supposed to be like the best kind of chicken. I don't know. But we've tried the chicken tenders before. They're good. Um, but I have leftover sliders, so we're going to cook these. And then rotate them. I didn't know there were so many. So we're going to use um, some skewers and do little mokies. They're called little mokies. <laughs> We're gonna do them on the grill and then some sausage. I bought barbecue sauce. And then if the kids want mac and cheese, we'll do mac and cheese. But this is kind of like a simple throw together meal. And then tomorrow I'm gonna do a crock pot meal out here again. Nice. This is a jalapeno cheddar one. These are from Amazon. Hold on. I will link them down below. So what you're gonna do is take these. Can you show me how you put them on the fire? Roast them a little bit. Give them a little bit warm. Give them a little bit warm. Oh. Mm -hmm. 
I'll do it for you. I'll just kind of set it right there. Okay. Spin it like this. Nice. I got it, I got it, I got it. Spin it, spin it. Mm. Oh, where's your hand on that? I know, but... Or you can put it right here. Look, there's a hot spot right here. Mm -hmm. Sweet baby raisin tastes different. I got the actual sweet baby raisin instead of the... What is it then? Mm -hmm. It's a different brand? I mean, a different flavor? No, it's tastes honey. Tastes smoky. It's honey barbecue. It's probably because it's in the... Are you yummy? It's because I haven't eaten it in a while. Is it yummy? Yes, it's yummy. You want to try it? <laughs> yes. Okay, if you don't like it, put it back on the plate. Mm -hmm. Oh, it does. It's real smoky. It's a chicken. No, like that. The sauce tastes real smoky. Mm -hmm. You taste the pickle burn on that too. <laughs> You're so sleepy. Okay y'all, so now I'm making one of the easiest meals ever. I'm cutting up some red potatoes. You could use yellow potatoes. You could even use just like russet potatoes, but I would probably peel those if your family doesn't like hard peeling. And I'm gonna put them in the bottom of the crock pot. I'm actually in my home right now because I'm gonna bring this meal to the camper with us later that day. Um, we're actually camping not that far from our house, so. It worked out that way but I'm gonna put a layer of these on the bottom of the crock pot and then I'm gonna cut up sausage and then I'm going to put a whole entire can of green beans but this is like a big can of green beans I'm gonna do Uncle Chris's seasoning olive oil and then I'm gonna cook on high for four hours Thanks so much for watching everybody. I really hope that y'all enjoyed this video. Stay tuned. I'm going to be sharing with y'all our camper remodel video. Then I'm going to be sharing with y'all a $20 challenge at Walmart where I make as many meals as I can out of this $20 bill. So it's going to be fun. I will see y'all my next video. Make sure to subscribe if you are new and enjoy it here. I will see y'all in my next video.